What made Kepler's supernova truly remarkable is that it happened in our very own Milky Way galaxy, in the constellation Ophiuchus, only about 20,000 light years away. For the people of the 17th century, this was not just an astronomical event. It was a mystery, a spectacle, and even a sign from the heavens. The supernova first appeared in October of 1604. At its brightest, it reached an apparent magnitude of minus 2.5, brighter than Jupiter, and nearly as bright as Venus. For ordinary stargazers, it was an awe-inspiring sight. For scholars and philosophers, it raised deep questions about the nature of the cosmos. This was a time when many still believed in the unchanging perfection of the heavens. The Aristotelian idea that the stars were fixed, eternal, and unalterable. Yet here was undeniable proof that the sky itself could change.